Welcome to the Crypto Breakdown, Kadena Whiteboard Mini-Series. In this mini-series, I'm going to help you understand every aspect about the Kadena blockchain from a first principle standpoint. In today's video, we're going to talk about Kadena gas stations. In part one, I explained what are Kadena gas stations and how they work. In today's video, which is part two, I'm going to make an animated video showing you how gas stations function on the blockchain. So in order to help you fully understand how gas stations work, I want you to imagine 20 different interstate highways all connected together. Each interstate is connected by a toll booth. So if you're driving a car and you wanted to go from interstate number one to interstate number 10, you would need to go through a toll booth. Now imagine if instead of paying the person working at the toll booth for driving on the interstate, they gave you a full tank of gas for free every time you pass through a toll booth. How cool would that be? Now imagine that interstate number one is not directly connected to interstate number 10. That would really suck, wouldn't it? If you had to drive all the way down interstate number five just to get over to interstate number 10. But what if the toll booth operator had a magical button that could teleport you from one interstate to the next? That would really blow your mind, right? Kadena gas stations work the exact same way, except Kadena gas stations are like magical teleportation stations. But instead of teleporting your crypto from one blockchain to the next, they burn it on one chain, they submit proof that those coins were burned, and then they recreate those coins on the destination chain. And the icing on the cake is the fact that this all happens in the background and the end user has no clue that it's even happening. So let me show you how this process works in Zelcor. Once we have Zelcor open, the first thing that we're gonna need to do is we're gonna need to get our public Kadena wallet address. The coolest part is that your wallet address is the same on every chain. So if we open up Zelcor and we click on wallet number one, then if we come up to the top and we click on the Kadena logo, on the left hand side, we're gonna click the receive button. Now this is going to open up a QR code. And if we click on the QR code, it will copy our public wallet address. After we have our public wallet address copied, we are gonna come over here and click on the send tab. This is going to ask for our D2FA pin. We're gonna click verify. Now that the withdrawal page is open on the left hand side of the screen, you're gonna see a chain drop down menu. We are gonna click on chain ID number one, just like interstate number one. You can see that I currently have 1171 Kadena on chain one. Now we're gonna swing over to the destination account tab. And if we right click where it says another or FIO crypto handle, it's gonna automatically paste our wallet address here. The chain drop down on the left shows which chain ID we wanna send from. If we scroll down to the bottom here, this chain ID says what chain are we sending to? This is our destination chain. We are gonna choose chain ID number 10. In the amount tab, we are gonna choose 71 KDA. That way we'll have roughly an even 1100 left on chain one and we'll have 71 coins deposited on chain 10. If I choose the chain 10 drop down right now, you can see that I have no Kadena on chain 10. Now the next thing I wanna show you is the gas free options. If you choose the economy tab, you can see that it is gas free. If you choose the normal tab, you can see that you are paying 0 0.000001 KDA, which is less than one one thousandth of a penny. If you click on the fast option, the gas fee is 0 0.00011 KDA, which is equal to 12 cents. We are going to choose the economy and we are gonna hit send. It will ask you, do you wanna proceed with this transaction? You're gonna choose yes and click send. Now you just have to wait 30 seconds and boom, you just completed your first ever free crypto transaction. Now, if we swing back over to chain 10, we can see that we have 71 KDA on chain 10. And this is why I laugh when I hear people talk about Kadena minor rewards. Would you rather pay Ethereum gas fees every time you need to use the network? Or would you rather have free transactions for the rest of your life? The miners on the Kadena network are rewarded properly for securing the network. In return, you can interact with any application built on the Kadena blockchain for free. Just imagine never spending another penny for a crypto transaction. Or better yet, just think about how much more crypto you'd have in your portfolio today if you never spent a penny on any gas fees or transactions. So hopefully you guys are all enjoying this Kadena whiteboard playlist. If you guys want to learn more about the Kadena blockchain, check out my two Kadena playlists linked down in the description. And if you guys want to learn more about trading crypto, come join us live on my second YouTube channel. 